What up, everybody? It's iPadBeatMaking.com here today on Saturday, May 29th, 2021, giving you some news you can use. Now, if you enjoyed this video, please be sure to hit the like button as well as the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you don't miss out on the latest news, tips, tricks, sales, beats, reviews, updates, and more. Now, if you missed out on the full news episode we released for this week featuring most of the sales and app updates as well as app info, be sure to check that out here. Now, for us here in America, things have been opening back up and it is officially Memorial Day weekend and that means lots of fun in the sun, barbecues, time with family and friends, but more importantly, great news for those of us looking for some much needed iOS music app sales. And the good news is there's been more developer involvement in the sales, which we will go over in a moment. But first we wanna highlight some of the major sales that will end this weekend that you for sure don't wanna miss out on. First off, we've got four different Swam Solo string apps, which are new releases with the bundle containing all of them, currently priced at $64.99. And each of them are priced at $19.99 individually. Now the individual apps will go from that $19.99 to $29.99, and the bundle will increase in price as well after this weekend. And there's more good news for those of you who missed out on the initial sale of the Swam Brass Collection, you now have the opportunity to get into that collection at that reduced $19.99 price as well. And one more time, I'm gonna repeat that the sale is supposed to end after this holiday weekend. So if you're interested, be sure to take advantage of those sales. And one thing I wanna point out, because I know a lot of you have iOS devices that don't have much storage space left on them, is that the Swam apps take up a really small footprint, and they also are saying that they're gonna have iPhone ports coming in the future. And I don't know if those will apply to the current apps we're buying right now, if they'll make them universal, or they will be separate apps, but it's definitely something to keep in mind if you're interested in those Swam apps. And another major set of apps that have gone on sale is the Yannick apps, but the main one I think you should for sure look at grabbing if it applies to your style of music at all is Tonestack Pro Guitar Amps and Effects. It's normally $10 and it's currently $5 and the pot of gold in-app purchase is currently only $29.99 when it was just at $59.99. So a big, big deal if you miss out on this sale, especially with that in-app purchase. And if you're interested at all, you should definitely jump on these deals ASAP. And that's not to say that the other deals or apps are less important, but the cost is a lot different for missing out on these ones specifically. Now, before we get to the sales, I just wanna mention one app that just got updated and that's Adam Piano Roll 2. And that update is as follows. They've added infinite undo. You can now edit fearlessly, which is great news. Improved channel targeting. Long pressing a channel show lock buttons will now toggle them exclusively for easier channel switching. Improved interplay between user configurations and custom styles. Now always using larger fonts when the selected configuration demands them. Configurations such as larger controls and sausage fingers support a quote included style field, which always applies with the specified style sheet. In effect, you can now use larger controls with larger fonts in combination with MIDI channel colors. Let me say this, that's great news. I've been loving the different color coding that you can get with the style sheets. It's super useful when you've been trying to build things out to have things color coded. It makes it really simple to understand. And they've also added a quote MIDI note data example style that shows all note info, including the notes octave, value, velocity, etc. And something to be aware of is when iOS notifies Adam of system-wide memory pressure, very old undo redo history will be discarded. So while the undo is infinite, it still is limited by the capacity that your device can handle. And with that said, let's move on to sales. Magellan Synthesizer 2 was $14.99, it's now $6.99. Casper was $19.99, it's now $9.99. Galileo Organ 2 was $14.99, it's now $6.99. Tone Stack Pro Guitar Amps and Effects, which we mentioned earlier, was $9.99, it's now $4.99. Talkworks was $7.99, it's now $5.99. Rock Sin Guitar Synthesizer was $19.99, it's now $9.99. 
Bleece Alpha Synthesizer was $14.99 and it's now $9.99. Chompler was $4.99 and it's now $3.99. Lo-Fi Dirt was $4.99, it's now $2.99. Fly Tape 2 was $5.99 and it's now $3.99. Fly Tape was $5.99 and it's also $3.99. Shimmer AEV3 Audio Plugin was $5.99 and it's currently $4.99. And MIDI Mixer for AUM AEV3 Plugin was $6.99 and it's now $5.99. And like I previously said, be sure to check out our original video for the news that we dropped here so that you will be able to catch the other sales that we have not mentioned right here in this video. But with all that said, we're about to get out of here. We hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, please be sure to hit the like button as well as the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you don't miss out on the latest news, tips, tricks, sales, beats, reviews, updates, and more. And be sure to check out some of the best kits available for iOS at iPadBeatMaking.com. It's iPadBeatMaking.com. Peace.